Hi to everyone. Uh, this is Yakub. Guys, in our previous video, we discussed about how to why why JDBC and purpose of JDBC we completed. And today in this video, I am I am going to explaining you. So how to connect Java application with database and performing the cloud operation, right? So simple thing, guys. To, to connect Java application with database and performing the cloud operation, there are five steps. So by using these five steps, simply we are going to communicate Java application with any relational database databases. So in that, the first steps are, the first one is register the driver class. Second one is a create connection. Third one is a create statement. Fourth one is execute SQL queries in database. Fifth one is close the connection. So simply what I'm telling. So to establish connection and performing the CRUD operation, performing the CRUD operation in JDBC, we have a five steps. The step number one is register the driver class, create the connection, create the statement, execute SQL queries in database, Next one is what close the connection, all right? And we'll discuss one by one with clear cut explanation. Now I am going with first statement, first step, register the driver class, all right? Simply, if you want to register the driver class into our Java application, we have a one method. The method name is what for name method, the for name method of class class, class class is used to load the driver class, load the driver to register with any relational databases. See, simply for name method of class, class is used to load the driver to register with database dynamically, right? Simply. And what is the statement? Simply what I am writing. So here is the class statement I am going to writing class. The method name is what for name, for name method. And here you can use a, our driver class thing. Suppose if you are going to using Oracle, then you can write here Oracle dot ADBC dot driver dot and Oracle driver, Oracle driver. This is what driver class name, driver class name. Then step number two, step number two create the connection, create the connection. So to create the connection with the database, here we are going to using one method. The method name is what get connection method, get connection method. And this method given by driver manager class, driver manager class, simply the driver manager class of get connection method is used to is used to create the connection with three properties. The first property is nothing but URL. Second one is username and third one is a password. So simply again, I am repeating to create the connection with any relational database between Java application to databases. Here we are going to using get connection method of driver manager class is used to create the connection with the database. Now I am going to showing the statement. So here you can use a connection interface, connection interface, and by using connection interface, we are creating one object with the help of driver manager class, driver manager class. And this class having a one method, the method name is what a get connection method, get connection method. And this method can hold three properties first property is nothing but a url and here url is what jdbc colon and database name oracle colon and here we are using fourth type of driver that is called p and and at the rate local host means my database running in running in my local machine so i am giving local machine and by using this 1521 port number and uh, now I am going to using the XC simply, simply, okay, simply by using JDBC API, I am going to communicating with Oracle database. 
with the help of a thin driver now my oracle database running in my local machine by using 1521 port number and xc stands for now i am going to using oracle express edition then after this and here you can use a your database name suppose i am giving one database name is called yakub db yakub db and my database password also i am giving same like this yakub db right so simply create the connection with any databases and we are writing second step is nothing but a connection con is equal to driver manager dot get connection of get connection of and here is the url the url is like this jdbc colon oracle colon tin colon at the rate local host colon 1521 xc next uh, username is nothing but uh, our database name and uh, and password is nothing but uh, my database password right this is the second statement and uh, third step third step step is nothing but a uh, creating statement guys please understand basically we can create statement in our jdbc in three ways so simply to creating statement they given three types of interfaces the first one is what statement interface second one is a prepared statement interface and third one is called callable statement sir when we use statement simply suppose you suppose you want to execute static sql queries then go with a statement interface suppose you want to you want to execute dynamic queries suppose suppose you want to give the values dynamically every time new data from from what uh, web form or by using scanner class so every time it will take the new new data okay from keyboard then what we call dynamic queries suppose you want to execute a dynamic queries then go with prepare statement in reality guys we can use a, a static a static queries very less but in reality we are going to using prepared statement at the same time callable statement right and even callable statement suppose callable statement also can execute dynamic queries but with the help of stored procedure concept right so finally what i am going to telling you statement can create in your jdbc by using three interfaces so first one is statement interface for static queries second one is prepared statement for dynamic queries third one is callable statement to execute our stored procedure concept right and suppose sir i want to create a sql query with static queries then how to write simple the create statement method of connection interface is used to create the object with create statement so what i am tell what i am going telling you create statement and next one is prepared statement next one is prepare call these three methods we are going to use in creating the statement okay but uh, to create before creating statement first we required statement object here statement object creating with the help of a connection interface object so simply what i am going to explaining you statement is equal to statement or statement and here my object stmt is equal to con dot create statement okay simply okay this statement this this statement telling you to execute the ddl command simply this stmt object is used for to creating the sql static queries the next point is prepared statement prepared statement and then how we can write so prepared statement ps is equal to con dot prepare statement and here you can give the your your dynamic query so simply and most of the time we can perform dml operations when you do inserting and deleting and updating updation operation then go with prepare statement the next one is suppose you want to create your statement with callable statement then write like this callable statement cl is equal to con dot con dot prepare call method and here you can give your stored procedure name right so these are the three types of statements we are going to using to creating the statement the fourth step is called execute sql query execute sql query guys understand guys understand so after creating sql query now i want to execute that sql query 
in my database. So execute your SQL query in your database. Statement interface given three types of methods. The first method is what execute update. Execute update. And this method we are going to using most of the time when you are, when you are going to performing insert operation, delete operation, and update operation. Right. And uh, after execute your query with execute update, this method must be written the integer value means Boolean expression. Boolean expression that is what true or false. So true means one and false means zero. Suppose after suppose your query is executed in database, either it may be insert and delete. Okay. If query is okay, it must be written the one. Okay, suppose your query is not executed, query is not executed in database, it can return zero, means query is failed. The next one, suppose how we are going writing. So int i is equal to statement dot execute update. Right? And one more method, execute query. And this method always using for select operation purpose. Select operation purpose. But when you use execute query, the execute query method must be written the result set object. Result set object. This is very, very important. Here, execute update written what value? Boolean value, either 0 or 1. But execute query method always written result set object. Right? So this is what our fourth statement. The last one is called close the connection. Close the connection. See, with connection interface, Okay, we started open the connection with database. Later created the statement. Next one is and executed our SQL query. And after query execution is completed, now, now we have to close the connection. Then how to close the connection? Simply, we are going to using one method is called close. Okay, this close method given by con interface, right? So these are the five steps we are going to using, okay, to creating to creating our connection with database and performing CRUD operation. So finally, I am going to writing here, please understand. Finally, finally, okay, in our Java code, finally, okay, our statements are, our statements are every day. Means when you perform, when you perform CRUD operation with Java application with database, every time we are going to write in these five steps. The first one is what class dot, per name of okay here you can write oracle dot jdbc dot driver dot and oracle driver right so first statement the second one is connection con is equal to driver manager dot get connection method get connection method and this method connect with database by using three property the first part property is what our url jdbc colon oracle colon in colon at the rate local host colon 1521 colon xe this is what our url then use our database name simply i am giving database name and next you can use a database password database password here you can use second statement and the third statement is what creating the statement and how i am going to creating and initially i am going to using here statement interface okay statement interface then i am creating one object with the help of on object okay to create statement by using create statement method create statement method so after creating statement suppose and you want to execute that query, simply I am going to creating one insert query, int i is equal to, and stmt dot, execute insert query, here we are going to using one method, execute update method, okay, and here I am going to writing the query, insert into, insert into employee values, Employee values here. I am giving one or thousand one, thousand one, and I am giving Orion and uh, address also something called Hyderabad. So like this, I am going to like this. Uh, I, I am going to giving the 
giving the data in my method so look at here and here execute update method okay go in database executed this query and if query is right it can return one value that is what one value here in i by using i i am going to getting confirmation is it my query executed or not then so to get clarification i am giving one statement system dot out dot print just i am returning the i value here i am writing what one record one record okay inserted one record inserted like this right? and this is what our fourth statement the last statement is not nothing but a con dot close so on dot close every time if you perform any crud operation means any any commands i either you can uh, create create the create command or insert command or update command and deleting so these five steps are common here what happened here query will be change right so these are the these are the five steps we are going to using to create the connection and performing with crud operation between java application to database okay thank you i hope you understand bye have a nice day